Waiting my turn. All of the L's I took or lessons I learned. Success it gotta be earned. Uh, tell me why they sleeping on me. everyone welcome back to our channel today I am going to be showing you guys um, what I'm currently using to package my customers units um, right here I'm just preparing this unit for shipping and I'm going to share with you guys um, some affordable packaging that you can get right now I do not have custom boxes I haven't gotten to that point where I have made custom boxes yet um, hopefully that's one of my plans for next year you know, I, I mentioned to you guys that we will be rebranding. So that's one of the things that I will be getting is custom boxes with my new um, logo on it, my new name and my new logo. So right now I just look for affordable boxes. I was getting boxes from Paper Mate, uh, Paper Mate, sorry, Paper Mart. But they, um, the boxes have become like way too expensive there. I think they're like more than like $3, almost $4 a box. The boxes that I'm going to be sharing with you guys today, I found on Amazon and these pink boxes, they're really cute. Um, you can use them to pack your, your wigs in and you can also use them for other things. Um, you guys out there, if you have, you know, lip gloss businesses and you're selling cosmetics, um, skincare products, anything like that. These boxes are really nice um, for that too. They're really appealing. Um, and they're a less than a, they come out to less than a dollar fifty a box, and it's that I think you know it's really affordable. And the boxes are really good. Like if you see here, like um, they're not you know um, that cheap looking, and um, they're pretty well made. And they also come in a smaller size um, as well as black, so you can also get them in black. I will leave the link to these boxes down in the description, so you can go ahead and click on my affiliate link and um, purchase these boxes if you're looking you know, for some new boxes. They come in a pack of 28. Um, so yeah, so it's really affordable and the packages are really nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and prepare this box to put my first wig in. The customer that I'm um, preparing the wigs for now, she has two units. So I'm gonna pack the first unit um, here, which I'm doing right now. I'm just putting my tag on and then I'm going to put this in the box. I'm just stuffing the wig with some paper to make sure that the unit is keeping its shape. Um, I'm going to stuff it and then I'm going to pack it. I want to make sure that the unit reaches my customer in um, really good condition. So I'm going to comb down the hair and try to get it to them, you know, in the same way that I pack it, the same way that it's styled and it normally does. So I'm going to take this. I normally don't put... Um, what do you call it? The nets on my straight wigs, my straight long wigs. I usually don't put a net. I just put it in the box and just cover it with the paper. I usually only use the hair nets for um, curl, like when I have curls, curly hair, or even my straight bobs I'll use it for, but I don't use it for the long hair. Okay, so that one is done. I'm gonna put it on the side and I'm gonna pack her other unit. I'm gonna um, get that one ready and um, get it packed up. And then you'll see, I'm gonna put, um, I'm also gonna put my logo on it. I have these logos that I made. I was using white boxes before I found these pink boxes. So um, these um, labels that I have, so I'm just gonna use them up until they're done, of course, I'm not gonna waste them. And then once they're done, I think I'm gonna um, order a few uh, clear labels to put on these pink boxes so it can give it a better look. I'm going ahead and package the second wig for her and then afterwards I'm going to get her goodie bag ready and put it in one of the boxes and then I'm going to use my own poly mailer to put the boxes in. And I just make sure that my packaging, since I don't have like nice, really nice custom packages, which a lot of us want, you know, we see, especially when we see businesses that have nice custom packages and it looks beautiful and everything, but you know, you got, you, they're expensive. It's expensive to get that made. So, you know, you can still have nice packaging, um, make, make sure everything is neat. 
and you know that's really all the customer cares about is presentation it's really it really matters so you just want to make sure that your packaging is neat and it's nice and it's clean so I'm gonna show you here these labels that I use but because I use I do use my own poly mailers most of the time I don't use the post office packaging sometimes I do but most of the time I use my own so I went to their website and I ordered these priority mail labels as well as the fragile labels and this will help um, my package to be recognized as a priority mail package um, so I just put those on the side and you know my package won't be you know just thrown about and not recognized as priority mail because most of my packages do reach my customers within two to three days so I put these on the side <clears throat> they're really good to use they're free so just go on the website and um, order them put the label and yeah she's done so now I have some other units that I'm going to get ready for packaging and that's pretty much it for this video I just wanted to share with you guys some affordable packaging some cute affordable packaging that you can use you always want your packaging the packaging is very important um, not only do you want your wigs to look really nice and everything you want um, when the units arrive to your customer you want them to be able to look at the packaging even the mannerism of my packaging like when my packages go to the post office like the people in the post office they know my packaging because they know the mannerism of which i um package my stuff so you know i always make sure that everything is just neat and when they open it up i just want to make sure that everything is neat inside everything is there and you know it really makes a difference and my customers they always mention it like they know my packaging you know so yeah, so that's it for this video. Um, I'm gonna leave the, the, the links in the description for the um, boxes as well as the poly mailers um, and the smaller ones that I use when I'm seeing it sending out um, single packages. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Until next time. I think it's time for the comeback. Yeah, I hope you ready for the comeback.